now here i am going to explain one beautiful thing i want to show you how can you save or how can you store uh, the data in tdms file data in the tdms file right click come into the file io and take here here you can see low level vi inside the low level vi is tdm okay tdm tdms tdms ni okay tdms is a file format and you can easily store yet okay uh, tdms data transmitting data okay you can easily able to store your technical data technical data management streaming tdm technical data management and streaming that okay during the streaming you can easily able to store your data you can easily able to store your data in the tdm okay no matter which kind of data you are acquiring but you will able to store that data very easily you can store the data in various group you can store your data uh, in various group you can store your data with the what can i say uh, various logic uh, sorry various group and various section definitely like you have you need a tdms create you need a tdms customizations then you need a tdms store okay but here let's see let's try to write a small tdms program to store the data okay tdms open take tdms write and tdms close these are the simple three steps as we used data to store okay we used uh, uh we used text file to uh, okay we used uh, data stored in the text file now right click make a connection like this i also don't know i am also i am also in that phase where i am looking how the system will work we'll try to learn the things on the same manner right click come here take a file path place here make a connection with this it's clear create control using this we can it, it is our enum and using this enum we can change something like create and replace new i want to create data okay now i want to store some more data suppose right click create sorry so here create control constant create constant i want to store signal s i g n a l signal i want to store right click create control sorry right click create constant i don't know what is their requirement but just take it if you will press control h and you will click so you will get to know group name channel name group name channel name so my channel name here i am i want to give the channel name my channel name here will be the time sorry will be the uh, random random just random okay now here we need a data which we want to store let's take a random number a random number functions okay a random number function this is the random number functions let's try to create the random number function but now you can see we are not able to store the random number data why because here something different if i will try to create control create control so you will get it will take a data as a array side array type sorry uh you know uh, waveform graph type uh next tomorrow i will explain all these things waveform graph chart and others so you will able to understand very well let's come into the array convert this data into the array take a build array functions and make a connection like this now connect now 
your system will accept the data because it will take the only array data okay and right click open the browse option create let's go to the 14 okay uh, tdm okay new data save new data save new data dot tdms tdms new data dot tdms run the program let's come here and check i got new data in the tdms file if you want so you can open with open this okay so how if if tdms tdm viewer is here here i am going to use one more functions here right click mm -hmm -hmm. tdm close right TDM viewer. TDMS viewer will help you to see that particular data. I am going to use this. Run. Now you can see here, it generates my data in the is file and I have only one data. Now you can see, just because if this TDM is not available, control Z, just a second. And if I will run the program, if I will run the program, so definitely I will get I will get this TDM data. Now you can see. If I want to open this, open this with uh, another app. app uh, let's take the Excel. Any Excel is here? Okay, we are not able. Okay, this one. Okay, double click. Now I am getting the data in the Excel format. And what different I will get? Look at here. If you will use the TDM data, then root name no. Okay, root name title author day numbers all these things we are getting and signal here we are getting the signal here here i am going to close the data close this tdm okay just a second now if in this program if i will come and i will take a while loop let's try to put all things inside the while loop Let's put all these things inside the while loop. Just a second. It's not a good uh, representation. Okay. Program should look good. No matter it's working or not, but it should look good first. So that uh, you can. Uh, debug any error or any problem now create stop till i will not press the stop button it will store the data and i want to control the speed i want only 100 sample every second 100 sample every second means this loop should run 100 time every second so i am given i have given the 10 millisecond wait Okay, now come here. Okay, open with this. Now open the Excel. Now you can see we are getting the data here. Random data. If I will, will use after store, if I will use here the TDM viewer, TDM viewer, if I will use a TDM viewer. And if I will run the program, I want to run this program for one second only. After one second, system, uh, pro, it will be elapsed. And in one second, you know, loop will run 100 times. Run the program. After one second, it will stop the program and we are getting this data. We are getting this data.
okay how many samples are here you can see nearly 99 sample we get we got nearly 99 sample so you can easily able to store the other information along with the other information you can easily able to store other information now set tdm s data s t o r s tdm data store 